Okay, Doc, I got the drill. Now let's get you out of here. Come on, start. Whoa, that seems awfully dangerous. Maybe you should have tested it first, mate. <laughs> what is Edna doing there? Mr. Corleone! You're too late! Too late? The doc's not supposed to be... Doc! They're moving him to another facility for safekeeping! Oh! I better go get a quote from the police chief! Paddy wagon intercepted. Suspect slain. And they're still after him. Oh god, that's not good. How am I gonna rescue him now? We'll take the bike. There's no way Edna's bike is gonna be fast enough to catch up with that paddy wagon. Or is there? Ooh, let's use Yes! The jet hmm. drill remains. At least the rocket part came out of this one piece. And let's put it on this big boy. Oh yeah. You did that with just your hands? That's impressive. Like you had no tools or anything. Alright, I'm coming, Doc. Whoa. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Seventeen cents for gas. That is pretty damn cheap. Move. You're still in danger, Doc. We've got to get you out of here. Oh, stop. I said you're still in danger. Never mind. Never mind. Get me out of here. I will talk later. Uh, door. They're left. I know. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, let's go right. See what's around here. Um. Oh, hello. Rear window. Sup, Doc? How you doing? Don't worry, I'll get you out. Okay. Oh god, okay, thank you. <laughs> Ooh, toolbox, sweet. Like in the start. Ooh, tire iron. And, uh, some here. Kid! What's he doing here? The hell? Keys. Keys. Oh. The window shut tight. Oh, his window's open. Right, okay, cool. Um, ooh, antenna. Neat. Alright, uh, go back. Nothing I can do there. I'm surprised that thing's still latched on. That, the, the little bicycle, that's impressive. Ooh, ooh, hold on, hold on. Let me try real quick using this tire iron on the doors. They won't budge. Ah, oh, well. Okay, I'll try. Um, what about on, oh, whoops. Wait, no, no, don't go, don't, no, G Marty, no. I'm trying to, go back, go back. I'm trying to get the freaking tire iron. All right, where is it, tire iron? There we go, and let's use it on the tire. That's a crazy idea. Whoa. <laughs> Got yourself a new Frisbee. Front window. Let's go over there. Come on, mate. Oh, God, this is dangerous. Um, uh, can we, uh, poke him in the face? Boop. Oh, no, okay, cannot boop. Um, Doc, what do I do? Uh, I found the keys. The keys are on the dashboard, but I can't reach them. You need a protection of pertinence. What? A reach extender. All right, I got one of those. Kid Tannin's driving the truck. Kid Tannin? That explains a lot. Uh, I need a distraction. Need distract a distraction. him. Leave it to me. Hey, driver. You're driving too fast. Watch how you take those curves. <laughs> uh, 
Why even? Not one day. Alright, there we go, come on. Nice and steady now. I'm surprised he hasn't heard that. Oh my god. Oh, oh. Yes! Smooth moves, Lamari. Nice! Hello. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh. Thanks, Doc. I guess that's why they call you the street. How did you know that? I have my sources. <laughs> you told us, mate. Alright, and let's go open you up. Here we go. You're free now, man. What? No, don't use the door. Okay, hold on. Okay, use the keys. I figured that'd be obvious, mate. Stand back, Doc. Oh, God. Hello. Oh, God. Why does he have it? No. Uh, where's my antenna? Oh, don't have an antenna. Use that. Oh, can I use this? Uh, have some of this. <laughs> um, let's take the gun. Now we can shoot, kid. All right, thank you. Oh, I see. We don't shoot, kid. We shoot the little shackles. Right, understandable. Oh, very nice. Oh God, this just went from bad to worse. Supposed to be. Um, the. Uh, hit the throttle. The throttle. Oh. No, he's going to crash into manure. <laughs> That's convenient. Any bones broken? Anyone dead? No? Doc! Are you okay? Holler if you're dead. I'm fine. But I wonder what sorts of bizarre repercussions my younger self's invention of a flying bicycle will have on the timeline. I don't think we'll have to worry about that. Did you know that would happen? I had a suspicion. I never could keep those rockets from exploding. And you gave it to so, us? What do we do now? Now we get back to 1986 before our interactions with the past inevitably cascade into a calamitous future. Where'd you leave Einstein? Uh, Doc? He's not in the pound, is he? No, uh, but I think we've got bigger problems right now. Great Scott! Oh dear. I don't know. You'll have to be careful not to run into ourselves. Hey, fellas. All right, McFly. Let's go see the boss. History says Tanner will be arrested by a rookie cop by the name of Danny Parker. I fear that nothing will save Hill Valley from descending into the fires of chaos and corruption. Nothing is over until Kid Tannen says it's over. Get ten in February 2010. Oh, geez, that's so far away. <laughs> um, Dr. Emmett Brown was performed by Christopher Lloyd. What? It sounds nothing like him. Huh. I thought it was just some sort of impersonator, but no. It's Christopher Lloyd. Huh. I guess that's what happens when you get older. You don't exactly sound like a younger self. Hmm. Impressive. Impressive that they managed to get actu actually get Christopher Lloyd. Although um, I'm sure if they had got like an impersonator, it would have sounded more like him, which is kind of weird. Having an impersonator that sounds more like the actual person than the actual person does. I guess that's because you know you sort of have that idea of what someone sounds like and will always sound like that. But then when they change their voice, it's like that's not them. That's completely not them. But it is them. Um. Anyway, thank you for sticking around, everyone. This has been the end of episode one of Back to the Future. If 
you enjoyed this, then you know, do like the whole rating, commenting, subscribing anyway. Uh, we'll be continuing in Back to the Future Part 2, or Episode 2, whatever. GG.